So I found this chick named Leah Houghton. I don't know anything about her other than I found her on my TikTok complaining about how a dude wouldn't let her fart. I was actually with this guy, we were dating, but this guy, he did not let me fart and he did not let me poop and- Whoa, I thought it was just farting. He did not believe that girls farted and pooped. That is sick. That is a sick way of thinking because everyone does it. The freaking Kardashians poop and fart. It is the most normal, most human thing that someone can do. And it is literally inevitable. Everyone does it. And if you don't, you're freaking, you're dead. So I don't know what this guy was thinking and what he was trying. If she's not talking about a relationship that she had when she was maybe in pre-K, um, Whatever guy that uh, she was dating was uh, brain dead. And, you know, I hope that now he's grown as a person because that is such a sick and twisted way of thinking. It's so beyond disgusting. And if anyone ever, ever tells you that it is unnatural and that you shouldn't be doing that stuff, get out of that situation because that is abuse um, to be told that you can't. It, yeah, it's abuse but it's not possible. It's imaginary abuse. What if somebody told you all of a sudden, hey, stop peeing, and you actually try to stop peeing, you know what's gonna happen? Psss, oops. This is a bit TMI, but I would go to his house and my body would like suck everything up. And for literally two days, I could not go to the toilet because he had implanted on my mind that I could not go to the toilet. And I would get really sick because of it. I would have really sore stomachs. I would get really bloated. And looking back, I would never do that again. And if you are in a similar situation- You did it to yourself. You got with a crazy person. We've all heard about toxic relationship stories, but have you ever heard about a partner not letting the other partner poop? It is the least normal thing that you can be a part of. But yeah, that is literally a form of gaslighting. He was gaslighting me into thinking that I wasn't a lady and I wasn't a pretty girl and I wasn't cute if I did these things because no other girls do it. He would say over and over, girls don't fart, girls don't poop. And I started to believe it myself and- I don't believe her. I can't believe her. And the fact that she would voluntarily stay in a relationship like that, if that's true then, I can't feel bad for you but I don't believe you at the same time. It's like a, I don't believe you. I think you're lying. But also, if it is true, you're dumb. But also, I don't think you would be that dumb. So yeah, that's why it's really important to make sure to tell guys when they are in the wrong, because you know, sometimes you'll tell them and they won't believe you. Like it just goes in one ear and out the other. So you can tell them, but you can also surround yourself with the right kind of guys, the right kind of men. And boys will be boys, but- Men will be men, boys will be boys. But even boys see girls go in the bathroom and then they finish their business. And when they leave the bathroom, they go, that smells bad. I think she, I think she did a poopy. Even a three and a half year old would understand. You heard her. She didn't say that the guy didn't want her to poop. He said that he didn't believe that girls pooped. The longer it goes on, the worse it's going to get. Another reason why they may be making you insecure is because they want more attention. Yeah, everyone makes mistakes. Okay. And then she goes and talks in circles for another 10 minutes and, uh, do we believe her? If she got with a dude that didn't believe that girls farted or pooped, I'm assuming this guy didn't grow up with a mom, didn't grow up with a sister, grew up in a all boy school. He didn't have contact with another female until he got to college. And then he just looked at the girl's bathroom and thought they probably just pee. Come on. But if that really did happen to this girl, Leah, I'm sorry that it happened. And I'm sorry that uh, you went through that. It sounds like uh, torture and uh, not a fun experience. I don't believe it. But even if it was true, I'm sorry. And uh, 
Guys, let your girl fart and let her poop in peace. <laughs>